hey guys welcome back to our another video this is your Preet again i have another beautiful blogging theme for you at the name news mug let me show you the demo of this theme you can see the layout very beautiful and the menu section you can see everything is possible and you can see the video section travel tech everything looks very nice it has different uh, wizards you can choose um, by categories when you scroll down you have sidebar uh, social media you have uh, uh, ads for your adsense when you keep scroll down you have a beautiful uh, footer section okay so in this video we will install and customize this beautiful template i will show you step by step how to make it a professional more beautiful for your blogging theme okay so let's get start the video i have already uploaded my theme you have to go to appearance themes you have once you got your um, theme file you have to upload your theme in the theme section the link in description with the discount you can purchase this news mug theme uh, this video is about installing the demo and uh, customize the front page so stay with me let me get start with uh, the news mug you will see the news mug section when you upload your uh, theme you will get this option news mug and you have to click on welcome when you click on welcome you will see some uh, dashboard look like this and you will see in the sidebar system status and it's saying wp memory limit should be 256 but we have only 40 mb so let's first increase our memory limit for that let me go to my c panel okay let me go back here let me go to my c panel in the c panel to increase the memory you have to go to multi php ini editor you will you have to click this once you open this section you have to select your domain first let me select my domain here any domain you have you have to select uh, your domain where you want to increase this limit and you will scroll down you will see upload max file size memory limit here memory limit you have to increase it up to 100 or 256 they recommend 256 i will recommend you 256 your memory limit and click apply now let's get back to our dashboard welcome dashboard here it asks to install some required plugin which is very important tag dip composer and social media counter let me click install one by one it will take time and you don't need to refresh your page it may break your plugin or theme you have to wait until you are all the plugin successfully activated we have done install our plugins now next option we have choose the choose to install pre-built website means the demo content let's choose our beautiful demo for our blog first here you have to look which type of blog you have for example you have a magazine food related car technology animal video section for example you have a youtube channel or videos you can install this theme it looks very nice technology tech related sport travel fashion classic blog you have a lot of option here guys so let me go ahead with default in the default section it will ask you to install this them demo include content include content you want to include the images the post all the content of a demo if you're a beginner uh, you can include the content but uh, let me uh, explain about the content demo content um, you have to upload your own images on post later on this is just for uh, for the demo purposes uh, you have to upload your own stuff later on so let me click on install it will install our demo content 
you can read this are you sure you want to install full demo and here another thing is notice this demo can be fully uninstall and system will attempt to roll back your previous state any content attachment created by demo are removable via uninstall button okay click yes and it will start installing our demo you have to wait till your demo content successfully installed then next step we have we will customize the front page we will make it more professional look more nice do not refresh your page while installing any demo or plugin it may break your theme so you have to care while you installing your demo it may take some longer time you have to wait till it finish the process as you can see our demo content is very near to install once our demo content installed i will show you our website how it look likes and then next step will be start editing one by one with them uh, with logo and menu sections wizards everything okay you can see our demo content successfully installed let me check my website now oh you can see guys it look very beautiful the similar very very professional now the time is to step by step edit our theme for that let me go back and i will click theme panel option in the news mug you will see theme panel let me click on theme panel okay here is the theme panel section where we will upload our logo we will choose our header style you can see our header style if i choose uh, this header style the logo will be instead of here a logo will be in between okay let me choose this style click setting that's if we got changes yeah you can see it look nice okay now let's go to top bar section first top bar section here this one you have a uh, you have a date time some pages and social media icons even you can choose the style of it okay if you don't want to show the top bar you can make it disable from here it will stop showing the top bar let me refresh it will not showing the top bar now no any pages showing but some of the sections we have still i will show you later on you have to select the top menu as you can see this is the demo uh, demo menu but we will make our own top bar menu later on i will show you so stay with me show social icons in the top bar the right side social icons so you can see here you want to keep it on or you want to disable you can disable show the date as i show you the date in the first you can disable as well let me show you with disable and refresh you will not see anything here in the top bar okay if you want to keep you can enable it okay keep scroll down and let's go to main menu section next section main menu okay in the header menu main menu you have to choose your menu if you not yet have menu i will show you how to create your own menu as i have we uh, we have uh, this is the demo menu we have all the posts here these all are demo post when we uh, upload our own post those will be look like this but you have to customize your menu uh, according your blog niche which blog and which categories you have we will upload later on okay let's go to mo uh, main important is logo let's uh, uh, you can see here the upload your logo the 272 by 90 pixel in png or jpg format you have to go to canva you can make your own logo here with same dimension you have to enter 272 by 90 
for that you have to go to canva you have to select customize size for your logo let me go back to canva let me go to main menu of canva so i will explain you where you have to enter this size so you will get exactly the same dimension of your logo but if you not yet have logo and uh, you don't know how to make the logo you have to scroll down in the text logo in the text logo section you simply have to provide your website name here in the text logo tagline you have to provide the tagline but if you want the logo you have to you can make your simple uh, you can make your logo in canva so it's now open let me show you where you have to enter the customized uh, size for your logo okay so this is the dashboard of canva if you have free uh, plan you can still make it so you have to click this create a design you have to click this create a design let's go to click create a design when you click create a design in the downside you will see customize size my internet connection is slow i'm sorry for that you have to wait so i can clear explain you how to create beautiful logo okay you have to click this customize size section customize size click it customize size click it okay here in the customize it will open look like this in the width you have to provide uh, 272 as we need 272 by 90 in the width you have to provide 272 272 two and in the height you have you will provide 90 and now click create new design now your design you will able to create your logo similar the size of your of our demo logo you can see the demo logo is the size is perfect when you now create in canva your logo width will be perfect and the height will be perfect as well okay once you already done the logo you can download as png or jpg okay so once your logo ready you will click remove the old one remove the logo old and click upload now we will upload our logo here okay let me choose my logo here as i have already the logo let me choose my logo again in the next section let me click save changes let's check out if our demo uh sorry if our website yeah you can see our logo already there and uh, the size i choose 272 by 90 i am um, it i have already uh, ready logo last time so this is just for to show you to choose the perfect size for of your logo okay go next favicon you have to provide the favicon it will show you will see the favicon in your top bar you you have to provide the favicon you can leave it later on you can do it in the logo alt attribute you have to provide website name for seo purpose logo for mobile you can upload same logo as well let me delete old one let me okay this is our mobile logo next section we have sign in and join if your website has a sign in or join option you can keep it otherwise i will recommend to make it off okay if your website like uh, community websites uh, you provide sign up sign in option then you can keep it on okay 
otherwise disable it click save changes let's go to next option we have here footer when you click on footer you will see the style number one the three column let me scroll down and you i will see the three section first second and three three layers in the footer okay because here in the style there is uh, three chosen okay you can even choose the two or one the single or you can choose as you want what type of content you want to show here i will recommend you can choose and the these three in the popular category um you uh, uh, it will show your category of your blog in the post it will show your latest post here in the first visit it will show the logo and some nice about us lines for your blog okay let's go to instagram setting if you have instagram you have to you can make the this enable and you have to provide the instagram id instagram id you will provide here do not include instagram dot dot com just to provide the id name of your instagram here okay footer info content this is what i explain you info content this is the info content news mug is your theme entertainment music fashion website here you have to provide your own blog lines you, uh, what is your blog about for example your blog about technology fashion lifestyle then you can provide the information that uh, about info about info in the photo logo again you have to provide your the logo which which will display in the photo section in the both provide your same logo and in the email address if you have a email you can provide your website email here you can leave it blank if you want to show social media icon in the footer like this under the contact us you can keep it enable or you can disable it as well save changes <coughs> another thing here footer background as you can see we have a background in the future in the footer you can see the black dark you can keep it or otherwise you can remove the background okay save changes let's go to sub footer setting okay you have to provide the copyright text about your website here and the footer menu this one menu per category menu you can make uh, uh, you can choose the same menu the main menu you can choose uh, top bar menu any menu you create you can choose your menu here i will later on show you the menu how to make it in the ad section if you have adsense then this is for you in the header you have to provide the adsense code ad code in the header then the image will be start showing in the header here this is the ad this will show in the header ad just to have provide the code in the header ad in the sidebar ad sidebar ad this one this is called sidebar ad again under here sidebar again okay you have to provide the adsense code here let's go to template setting template setting uh, i recommend you keep it default everything looks good here okay you don't need to make any changes here categories categories template let me click any category here let me click fashion uh, fashion or news let me go down click any category here like entertainment this is the category when in someone click the category they will see the first uh, the big slide bar in the category there are another sub categories they will able to see here and they scroll down they will see that category post okay okay let's go to post setting let me open any post here you will see the post the title we have beautiful title and the date and the how many views your post has the comments okay and the social media default post 
template if you want to keep it default you can keep it default if you want to make changes in the post you can choose style number one let me show you if that changes let me refresh here you can see we have changes now we have the image and we have text one side but i will recommend default default is good let's go to post and custom post type if you want to show the category tags scroll down there are category tags if you want to show the tags here you can keep it enabled if you want to show the other name who write this post you can enable or disable you want to show that date in the post and when you scroll up this is the date here you want to show the date you can enable or disable you can choose any setting here about your post what type of uh, things you want to show in the post feature image yeah feature image this is all feature image feature image uh, use light box or no light box you can uh, just uh, simply enable it by default it's enabled do not need to do anything in the related article which is more important when someone open your post they will scroll down they will see related article which is uh, i always recommend to my blogger people you have to show the related post in your in your post related post means the same category post uh, the viewers will see you can even make some changes here you want to uh, show the related post by category same category or by tag you can choose how many uh, rows you want to uh, show one row in one row three post like this is one row if you want to choose two row they will see two rows you can choose two row in related post more article box you can uh, enable the article box in the article box there you can choose uh, how many posts you want to see in the same category or different category view count you can enable the view count how many people view your post here this one you will see the eye icon and number two two views you can enable it or disable it video setting you if your blog has some videos in every post you can choose uh, here enable pause hidden player enable lazy video on mobile i recommend this if you have a video blog enable playing only one player yeah one time one player choose save changes let's go to another uh, important setting here blog setting keep it default some important setting here i will say uh, if you want to make some changes in the color theme color choose the theme color you can uh, you can change the color of your top menu top menu text color you can change the color of the top menu or main menu you can make any changes for the colors okay the important thing here let's uh, try to customize uh, the front page here the content main content let me refresh okay this is our front page now let's start customize one by one you have to click edit page here if you are using see uh, if you're using the uh, panel you see this wordpress panel in the front page you can click simply click edit page or otherwise you have to go to pages click all pages you have to scroll down you have to look for your front page where is your front page okay this is the front page you will see the in the black color front page here you will click add it with tag div composer only add it with tag div composer because it's support tag div composer and when you add it to the front page it it you will f uh, feel like it's very simple you don't need to do anything bigger okay now let's scroll down to first section you can click anywhere in the left side you will see some options opened when you click somewhere so let's make changes in the uh, in the slider this slider i choose okay here more important thing here when you click on filter 
the option here which category post you want to display in the first section you have you can choose the category as well like fashion i choose fashion only fashion category post will be shown in the first section okay or if you want to choose all category or even you can choose the popular post which uh, more popular post uh, it will uh, show in the first section you can choose this in the short order click highest rated or you have to click popular popular are all the time it will start showing only the popular post in the number one in the first slider people will see which popular post your blog has even you can provide the name of it you can provide the name of this slider or popular post okay let's go to next fashion week again click anywhere the right button of your mouse you will see custom title you can custom the title this title fashion week let me delete the week i keep only the fashion when you choose the fashion and this is the title and now we have to choose the fashion category same category go to filter in the category filter choose fashion now it will show fashion related categories here fashion related post here in the sidebar there is you remember there is a sidebar ad if you not have adsense yet simply go to this delete button scroll up and you will see delete element click it delete this ad and it will not show in the side we have popular video section if your blog has videos if your blog has no any videos you can do simply provide the only delete the video title only provide the popular in the popular go to filter in the filter choose in the short order choose the popular it will show popular post here instead of videos you can make any changes like this holiday recipe let's click again the mouse general holiday Re recipe let me see the other category we have social media or uh, we can go with the uh, gadgets let me click category gadget it will uh, gadget related uh post will be shown here if i choose gadget then definitely i have to provide the gadget title instead of holiday let me choose gadget the title it will show gadgets here okay gadget uh, when we uh, scroll down you will see gadget world again in the gadget world i will choose the category entertainment just you have to go to filter and choose entertainment now in the general i will give it name entertainment and it was showing the title showing here keep scroll down every time you make changes please do not forget to click save all your content otherwise you have to go through one by one again Keep scroll down we have another uh, section best smartphone if you have a blog has no any smartphone category you have to choose the category your blog has first thing here if your blog has your own category like uh, your blog may be technology fashion lifestyle important thing here i want to share with you first of all when you install the theme first go to the after install the demo content <clears throat> after install the demo content go to post and click categories first choose the category or delete the old category which your blog not has or you not deal with or you not provide that related niche provide your own category enter the name here slug name keep the same slug for example let me choose here uh, let me choose crypto 
name Kipto. I give cryptocurrency. I gave name Kipto. I in the slug same name Kipto and click on add new category. You will see Kipto category will be there because when later on we will add post we simply can choose the category now we have a crypto category go back to the section when you click here you will not see crypto until we refresh it let's refresh it and we will go back again to the smartphone section we will scroll down when you save your uh, last work when while you add it and you will not see any changes you don't need to worry because you already save your work last work here here we were click best smartphone and uh, now click filter we will choose you will see now crypto here in the number one crypto you will not see any post here because you not yet create any post related to crypto you can choose here later on you can when you create post in the category choose crypto they will start showing here in the name instead of best smartphone provide same title crypto post or articles it will show here crypto. okay save changes okay once you already your category already ready then you start editing later on first to make your category each category you don't need other category one by one select all you don't need or you not create post related choose all scroll down delete all those first to fix your categories and later on it will be simple for us to choose our own categories in the filter section choose your own categories here so this is very simple keep scroll down keep add it one by one so this is really simple in the sidebar let me explain about this um, social media icons how you can uh, provide your own social media links here you have to go back let me go back here in the news mug section let me click on let me go to plugins let me check if the plugin already there you will see social counter plugin okay it's already there now we will go to theme mug we will click here theme panel when we click on theme panel you will see social network click social network click on social share social share keep scroll down which uh, which uh, social media you want to show just uncheck the other okay if you want to for example linkedin you can check it with the blue tick keep scroll down in the facebook account provide your facebook account in the instagram provide your instagram instagram business and in the down you will see social network you can provide your one by one link here for example we have uh, a facebook twitter and youtube okay facebook twitter youtube you have to provide those facebook twitter youtube okay you have to provide all the links one by one let me go back okay now scroll down to the advertisement you can you have to put uh, if you have advertisement you have to uh, here if you want to keep it in the sidebar you have to go back let me go back let me open okay 
if you have already adsense you have to go to ads as i explained earlier you have to provide all the codes in the sidebar code article top article inline all the ads will show in the articles as well you have to provide it if you want to delete you can delete simple let me refresh here again okay now i refresh when i refresh again i will show you for the social media uh, for the advertisement you will see some of the sidebar is not editable some of the section not editable like this under here not editable what we will do we will go back to our front page of website front page here click customize Clus customize or you can do is you can appearance click appearance or customize you will see same section there here click on visits when you click on visit news month default you will see click it here you will see all the options here which not able to edit these were not able to edit because these sections are in the visit section okay now let's add it one by one right click mouse here in the custom title when you scroll down you will see here start from the facebook id provide your facebook name not the complete uh, url you have to provide only the name here in the twitter provide again in the youtube provide the url not youtube dot uh, dash channel you have to provide the after that uh, the name only or the url of your channel only okay even you can uh, provide the number how many um, uh, how many viewers you have subscribers let me enter 6000 you will see 6000 the number here in the subscribe section of social visit just to wait you will see here 6000 subscriber you can choose like that now you can provide the number here instagram users in the this is very simple now let's go scroll down you will see next section advertisement here this will be editable here if you have advertisement right click mouse simply provide simple scroll down add title provide the add title this is the title advertisement or you can simply click on three i dot scroll down remove legacy visit i click it and our ad will stop showing here it will delete it from here you can see after social media we have again some post we don't have any ad here now okay in the editor pics editor pics we have here right click again mouse provide the title if you want to keep editor pics or article or admin pics you can enter the title scroll down scroll down keep scroll down and you will see here limit post number how many posts you want to display in the sidebar one two three post four post we have you can provide five six any post number here okay how many post you want to display here you will see instead four we have now six post you can see one two three four five six in the side in the editor pics scroll down okay now how we will choose the category here you will click this filter click filter here choose the category if you have already make the category you can choose the category here if you want to choose 
the popular post the random post you can choose already choose random post here you can choose popular all time post anything you can choose here in the filter section always choose the category or choose the uh, which what type of content you want to show in the filter section general section is about for the title choose title url uh, the design that call header template templates okay that's in the general section let's scroll down if you want to add any more section down after the editor picks you even can add some more just click on add block you can choose anything like uh, let me click on image it will show image here under the editor picks you will see blank image yeah, here let me click on ideal media library let me choose any post here just for example to show you how you can add more stuff in the sidebar like that we have now showing the post here this is how you can add in the sidebar just you have to go to let me delete this first three dots let's remove image okay we have removed the image from the sidebar okay all good this section all these sidebar section are available in the when you click the customize when you click the appearance when you click uh, the customize in the customize it will look open look like this click on visits the uh, news mug default you will see all the sidebar sections here so that's all so i hope you like this video please please like and share subscribe my youtube channel for your to i really appreciate for your support i bring more nice videos related to technology blogging social media tips a lot more nice videos time to time so i really appreciate thank you so much for watching this video